walking here? I'm in Brooklyn, New York. How's it going? Um, we're in Brooklyn, New York. We only have one day here, which is really annoying. I would have loved two days, but we're in Brooklyn, New York. I don't know exactly where, but my goal is to walk from here across the Brooklyn Bridge, go see the Empire State Building. It's a, it's a long one, but we got time. It's only, it's not even 11 yet. So we're gonna go and do that and see some sights along the way. Come for a walk with me. I don't know what uh, building that one is. That is a that is a whopper. That is a massive one. Look at the size of it. It's in the clouds, for God's sake. Now walking onto the Brooklyn Bridge. It's very New York, as you can see. It's New York. There's people doing graffiti just over there. It's like in plain view of the public. I love it. But we are going onto the bridge and then into. I guess what is that? Is that Manhattan, right? The Long Island, the, not the Long Island, the <laughs> the. You know, the, the big New York bit. That's Manhattan, right? I don't know. But I'm going onto the bridge. I'm going on the bridge. I'm going on the Brooklyn Bridge in New York. I need to find that street where um, loads of people take that photo of the Brooklyn Bridge. I think it's called Dumbo, like in the Dumbo area or Dumbo Street. I'm not entirely sure. But look, it's New York. I'm in New York. This is a very long bridge. All right, speak to you on the other side. I think it's safe to say that I'm officially in New York. Look at that. That really is New York, isn't it? So I've come across on the Manhattan Bridge. I'm going to go back on the um, on that bridge there, the Brooklyn Bridge. Look at that. This is crazy. Okay, update. I'm in the Washington Square. No, I'm not. Washington, that's the Washington Archway right there. So I go through there and then go on Fifth Avenue or Fifth Street, Fifth whatever, and then go straight up. And that's, um, and then I'll hit the Empire State Building. I have walked way too far. This was much too big of an undertaking for a day off, but you know what? We're living the dream out here. in New York for less than three hours and um, I love it. I absolutely love it. I'm currently eating a lovely sandwich lunch under the shadow of the Empire State Building which I'll show you in a second. It's right there. Absolutely mental. People crossing the street when they're not supposed to. I hear all the cars beeping but no one crashes. The hustle bustle. It's fabulous. It's wonderful. I love it. Uh, this was a bad decision. <laughs> I have walked so far to get to the Empire State Building and now walking back across the Brooklyn Bridge, came over on the Manhattan Bridge, go back across the Brooklyn Bridge. This is what I would call um, really fucking far. <sighs> I don't even know where I am at the moment. Have I been here before? I don't think I've been this way because it's taking me a different way back. Um, but it's far as hell. So I walked over on that bridge over there. I walked all the way to the Empire State Building right there. And then I walked back all the way to the Brooklyn Bridge of which I am now walking across. This was, um, this was a bad idea. I have never walked this far um, on any off day. This might be the furthest walk I've ever done, like in my life. This is was this was um, a bad idea, and uh, I'm not even remotely close. I still have to go like into Brooklyn once I cross the bridge. So, but we're here. We're in Brooklyn. I ain't seen the Statue of Liberty yet. I don't even know where it is. I don't know if it's over there or if it's over there. I don't know. <laughs> There she is. Three days later, Albany, New York, after I've been to Brooklyn, Providence, Rhode Island, Manchester, New Hampshire, three days in a row, we find ourselves in Albany. It's, uh, I got off, I got to the hotel at nine. I literally went back to bed 
I got very little sleep. It was the last three days were very hard. I look a wreck. It was emotionally draining. It was physically really draining. Um, we're in Albany, New York. It is 2.30 or something like that. And I haven't eaten. So we're gonna go get food. Because um, we're back at it again tomorrow. So here we go. I had no idea what um, Albany was gonna look like actually. Never been here. Um, so it looks very cool. I'm just making my way to a little coffee shop for a sweet coffee and then I'm gonna go get some food. But it looks very cool. Capital city of New York State, obviously. Looks very nice. Montreal. Let's go have a look. Yeah. Uh, and then you, you are no longer participating in the game. Do you know that before going into the game? So, well, you know that as soon as he comes out, as soon as he comes out, he's trusting him. Montreal's crazy cool. Sorry there hasn't been much to do or much for you to see over the past couple of days. I've been really busy and then I, on off days I've been sleeping. So Montreal is a gorgeous, look at those people up there, having their balcony dinner. Welcome to Quebec, Quebec, where it is raining. Look at that. This is a castle slash hotel where we are staying and apparently it's haunted. Apparently I've heard it said it's the only walled city in America. These are literally the walls that border it all the way around, which is pretty cool. Let's go find some food. Extremely pretty Quebec. It's such a shame that it's raining today because it's gorgeous, full of old buildings, old architecture. like really cool, lovely looking, lovely looking things. I don't even know the last time I spoke to you, um, but we're in Cincinnati. I don't remember the last time, I can't remember the last time I said video, it may have been Montreal, I think, but that was quite a while ago. I don't think I filmed anything in Quebec because it was raining the whole time we were there. Um, so I didn't go out. But it was very pretty in Quebec. Wish I could have filmed some stuff. I think I got some photos. I must have got some photos. Or maybe I did get some video. I genuinely can't remember. Um, but we're in Cincinnati. On the hunt for some munch. And I've been told very reliably by a local source that there's a place that does really banging sandwiches um, that's just down the road. So we're gonna go do that. It's so hot here. It's unbelievably hot here. It's like, it's gotta be like 88 degrees, but like also slightly humid. It's very, very warm. Um, yeah. Is this a one-way street? I don't know, we're just gonna cross. The last couple days have been pretty, um, pretty good. We had, um, I worked three days in a row. Tiring, but successful, ultimately, which is great. Um, and really, once, once over the next five days, the hardest part of this leg is over. Um, and then it's like smooth sailing. So it should be really exciting. Food achieved, big heavy sandwich. Hopefully it'll be lovely. I'm gonna go back to the room now and relax, watch the rest of Stranger Things and uh, prepare for the shows ahead. Milwaukee, Wisconsin. Let's go have a look. Look, it's the Pfizer Forum where the Milwaukee Bucks play, where Giannis hangs out. It is a uh, really quite 
desertedly not busy at the moment. I know that there's, I know that nothing's going on, but like it's really there's not a lot of people around here. Uh, we're gonna go look and see if the pro shops open and uh, see where we can find any goodies in this place. So we were just over there by the arena and now we're here on a river. People rowing, big boats, very picturesque. And they're coming around the left bend here, absolutely stunning driving for homes in the G cart, coming down to stop sign on right. As the track gets a bit bumpy and the birds fly out of position, rounding the left corner and down the hill. Passing wooden barricade on left as he goes down past Jungle Hill. Concrete stump on right, through the wooden shack. Kansas City. I actually think we're still in Missouri. Uh, I actually don't know which side of the river we're on. But um, yeah, Kansas City. In the last nine days, we've had seven shows. It's been pretty wild. But now it gets a little bit easier and we're very much on the, on the downward, the downward stretch, the home stretch, if you will. So, um, I can't believe already it's been it's been so quick honestly but we'll see what we can find around good old kansas city and next time you speak to me i think i will be in colorado that's not right is it no idaho i don't remember either way very gorgeous day here in kansas city sun is shining Slight, slight breeze through the streets. It's very nice. I know nothing about Kansas City other than some of it's in Missouri and the Chiefs live here and it's about it honestly. I don't know. Colorado Springs. Snowy mountain caps, 5,094 feet. Bum, 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 bum. right next to the United States Olympic and Paralympic Committee. Got a little high street, breakfast place, that's where I'm going to be eating. And, uh, yeah, not too shabby. Snow-capped mountains, feels very modern cowboy town. Okay, walked around a bit, had some breakfast. I've got a haircut at 2.30, fancy, fancy. Trim myself up, look fresh for the last, what is it? 11 days we're out here. And uh, yeah, good days, good days. Salt Lake City, Utah. We are here until tonight, and then we get back on the bus to go to Idaho. <laughs> so it's just like a day stop. Um, really hot. I didn't think that Utah got this hot. I'd never been to Utah before. I didn't think it actually got this hot. I'm gonna go get some tacos, walk around a bit, watch the NBA Finals game tonight, chill out. And now we're in Seattle. The last time I was in Seattle, it was like 10 years ago. Me and my dad came up here for a Chelsea preseason game. Uh, they came across and smashed up the Sounders, but literally flew up from San Francisco, landed the morning of, and then uh, went to the game that night, went back the next day. So, um, not gonna lie, I'm taking a lot of my sights, like my, uh, my, my landmarks and where I'm going from The Last of Us 2, because I know that so much of that game was mapped out um, as Seattle. So, I recognize this building, as many people might. Don't know what it is, but I know <laughs> I recognize it, so I know that the courthouse is this way and then downtown, like the shops and all that will be closer down to the water, I believe, fish market and such. So we'll go have a look and see what we can find. You know how we be doing. I do 
love Seattle. It has a, its own unique, a dare I say, vibe to any other city in America that I so deeply enjoy. It's very, very cool. So nice here, I do love it. Pike's Place Market. That's not a bad view, is it? Just walk through Pike's Place Market, saw all of it, the original Starbucks and all that. that there's a stadium over there. Saw Chelsea play the Seattle Sounders there 10 years ago. Not a bad day out. Vegas. What did I get in what? so hot. It's unbelievably hot. There's a cookie monster on the... You see the cookie monster? On the... Right there? On the freeway? The freeway? <laughs> it must be a Mexican icon. 